Creating lids manually in an assembly is very similar to how you do it in a part file. The only difference is you have to incorporate some basic top-down design technique to add the lids as their own part files. To add lids to this assembly, I'll go to Insert, Component, and select New Part. Before I can start working on the part, I'll first need to select a face or plane to start on. I'll select this front face of the pipe and am automatically placed into Edit Sketch Mode. I'll use the same process for manually creating lids in a part and use Convert Entities to convert the inner edge to sketch entities before using a mid-plane extrusion to create the lid. Easy enough, right? One thing to keep in mind is I recommend creating individual lid parts for each opening you're trying to cover. That way you can apply different materials to each of the lids if you need to, which can be useful, especially if your analysis involves heat transfer. And the lids serve as insulators of different materials, for example.